Yeah. Okay, what's your name? Uh, my name is Joe. Hey, Joe. I own a, I own a motorcycle shop called Smoking Joe's in Nepal. Yeah, here and, it is. Uh, yeah. Right up here. Okay. Hey, hey, there we go. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, uh, I just, yeah, I've been waiting to see Joe actually because we were on, we did the poker run together to poker up. And anyway, a few things happened on the way back, and he just pulled up a minute ago. So can you kind of tell me what happened, basically? Yeah, so I met Stephen in the poker run, and he talked to my wife, and she had some back problems, and he prayed for her and made it better. And so it just so happened on the way back, my front tire blew out on my motorcycle, and it was uncontrollable, and the bike spilled over. And I got a little road rash, and I got some chip bones, probably. But Stephen prayed for me that night, and I would say that my back went from seven and a half Mm -hmm. to over time down to a one, a point five now, but yeah, the, the power of God and the power of miracles really works, and <laughs> I want to thank Stephen for being in my life and praying Sweet. for me and just being an absolute good guy uh, and wow. a man of God. Well, man, thank you. I'm just, I'm glad it was, and it all happened over the phone, through your son, actually. Yeah. Remember, I asked your son to lay hands on you, and then yes. I told your son what to do. Because, you know, it's not, it's like it's... It's actually something God's given all of us, really. It's just something we have to access and, and just uh, command to happen. So, yeah, when I heard about the accident, oh my, your wife had told me, I mean, my heart was, oh my God, what happened? Is he okay? And she said, no, he's not. He's not doing good. And can you even pray for him? And I said, well, how am I going to pray for you three hours away? That's what so we did it all over the phone, right? Yeah, we did it all by phone. I remember that, yeah. My and, uh, son, he, he, he witnessed to me through the phone, through Stephen. And, <laughs> yeah, that's pretty cool. uh, so, yeah, everything's, is, everything's good and there's a lot going on in my life and it's all coming back together. Awesome. Yeah. And, uh, just thank the Lord for everything. Yeah, that's all right, man. It's been a real pleasure meeting you, actually. And I'm, what did you do before, just out of curiosity? What is your profession? Uh, so my occupation is I'm an aircraft mechanic. Okay. And uh, so now I'm trying to get into the bike business. No, that's, that's right. And you married in Nepali, right? Yeah, that's that's definitely the one that I made and prayed for, right? Cool. And you got two kids, right? Yes. Yeah, okay, awesome. Okay, man, thanks. Appreciate it. Thank you, bro. Yeah, that, can you tell me just what happened a second ago? Yes, my pen, it just took away. <laughs> <laughs> took it away. I didn't take it away. Who took it yeah, away? It, it's, it was beaming. Yeah? On a scale of 1 to 10, I asked you how much it was, and yeah, it was what? What did you say? Yeah. It was a 7, and then I prayed, and no, what happened? It's like 1. Now it's down I to 1. Like Isn't that awesome? Just because my, yeah. heart, my back hurts so bad since like 5 days. I hope it will be the same like for the rest of the day. That's okay. Okay. So who healed you? Jesus. That's right. Yeah. Isn't that cool? So you commanded him. Yeah. Thank you, Jesus. And who's in your heart? Jesus. <laughs> All right, very cool. Okay, so I'm here in Joe's, what do you call this place? Smoking Joe's. Smoking Joe's. Okay, obviously it's a bike shop, as you can see here. Yeah. And uh, anyhow, we've met at the poker run, yeah. the three of us before. And what's your name? I'm Rokshit. Okay, and? Um, Sabar. Okay, and? Uh, I'm Mom. Um, Cool. Okay. Hey, listen, I just wanted to ask you guys just real briefly, just a few minutes ago, I talked to you about Jesus and asked him to come into your hearts. Cause, uh, who's in your heart now? Jesus. <laughs> okay. How about you? My girlfriend. Your Jesus. girlfriend. <laughs> okay, that's cool. Yeah, Jesus. Okay. So anyhow, the big the question I just wanted to ask you real quick was, when you came in, mm -hmm. and I was just talking, can you kind of tell what happened, what you saw the other night there in front of the... Uh, the in the poker run? Yeah, that, right. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah we, uh, we were in a buffet line, mm -hmm. so you met some uh, Indian guy and you started talking about uh, how Jesus is, uh, he, how he exists in our heart and uh, then you start giving him demonstration. Uh, just what, what's that demonstration? What is that? What do you, mean? Uh, you took out his hand yeah. and you were like, Jesus, come into <laughs> this man or something, you did okay. your thing. And this guy was like, oh, my hand is cold now. <laughs> and he was like, yeah. Yeah, I've got Jesus in my heart too. <laughs> and that's that. Cool. All right. Awesome. And also, what happened to your boss? Uh, um, with the, the uh, Devika. Remember her back? Oh, I wouldn't know that. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. She was, uh, we, were, we were on the long tool, right? Mm -hmm. And she was having this back pain. Right. And then you, again, you know, do your, uh, you put your hand and, and, and pray. And she was fine uh, evening, so yeah. She got healed, right? Yeah, she got healed, yeah. That's cool. So who's doing all that stuff? Uh, Jesus. Yeah, yeah, that's right, amen. <laughs> okay, guys, thanks. Appreciate bye. it. All right, bye. Okay, yeah. see ya. ...to condemn the world, uh, but to save the world through him. Whoever believes in him is not condemned, but condemned already because he has not believed in the name of God's one and only Son. 